Hey there, restaurant owners. Are your labor costs spiraling out of control and eating into your profits? Do you feel overwhelmed trying to keep these expenses in check? You're not alone, and I'm here to help. Welcome to the fifth video in our special seven-part series where we'll tackle this labor cost pain point head-on and give you the tools to regain control. Each video in this series will cover an important step to help you manage and reduce your labor cost effectively. Whether it's auditing timekeeping, cutting down on unnecessary overtime, or optimizing your schedule, we've got you covered. So, stay with me and let's solve this problem together one step at a time. Ready to get started? Let's dive into today's tip and take the fifth step towards controlling your labor costs. Hey there, Restaurant Pro. This is Dave Scott Peters, restaurant expert, coach, and creator of the Restaurant Prosperity Formula. Today, we're going to focus on how your managers can proactively control your labor costs when they schedule. Are your managers just copying one schedule from one week and pasting it into the next week, right? That's the magic of scheduling software. Copy, paste, done. That has nothing to do with sales, does it? So step five is management must schedule staff according to the sales and staffing guide that you've created. Bringing in too many people or bringing them in too early can throw your labor cost off, just out of balance, because you are literally using dollars that you didn't need to use. So what do we do? We start off with having a sales forecast and the sales forecast needs to be by day of the week. Right? Not just a, hey, I think I'm going to do $150,000 next month. What are you going to do that week? And then break it down by day. Beautiful part is we've got lots of history, our POS system. We've got our DSR tracker. We've got our QuickBooks. You've got plenty of places where that information lives. Easy to find. So that way we can use it for forecasting. Next, you've got to use a staffing guide. How many cooks? You've got to tell your, your team how many cooks they need in the AM and how many need in the PM to staff properly. Or better yet, because today we have staffing software, scheduling software, you have the ability to build templates. So if, let's say you're using seven shifts. You can build a $40,000 week template for your kitchen. You can buy, build a, a $45,000, a $50,000, a $55,000, so on and so forth. Literally put in what time each position comes in, what time they go home, that it will be dead on budget. This is powerful. It is worth every minute creating those templates to use to make sure we're not overusing our labor cost. Now you also have to understand that when you get busy certain days, there's some randomness to getting busy anymore that all of a sudden you knew you had three servers on for a lunch rush on a Tuesday, but you had your ass handed to you. And next thing you know, you are, you as a manager are running around crazy. The owner's running around crazy. We're all just trying to take care of all these guests, make sure they're happy. And everybody's exhausted at the end of the day. So now that manager working that shift goes to the person, the manager who writes a schedule for servers to go, Hey, I need another server. We had our ass kicked. Then we schedule that extra server. What is it? It's dead. Like dead, you're sending people home. You could have done it with one server. There's this little bit of randomness in the restaurant business that has been around for decades now. With that said, so what do I do? If I have my ass kicked one week, don't do anything. If I have my ass kicked the second week, don't do anything. If I have my ass kicked the third week, it's time to change your schedule. Three weeks makes a trend. That's the same for if sales are going down. It's important that we use the hours that we have and not overspend. Be sure to join me live every Friday at 8 a.m. Pacific time on YouTube, travel schedule permitting, where I'll get you pumped about the upcoming weekend, get you excited about crushing your goals and finding the motivation to be best you possible. Plus, I'll answer your burning questions live.